Hi, well, I just wanted to show you what came in the mail today, and it's the 16th, and I got an email back on the 9th, the 8th or the 9th, saying that my birch box had shipped, and they, of course, are using a new fulfillment center and a shipping center for sending out all sorts of things, and I was excited to hear that, and I was wondering if it would get here sooner, and it is here a couple of days sooner than normal, and I know it's shipping all the way from New York State. Or is it from New Jersey? Yes, it's from Cranberry, New Jersey. So, um, and the one thing you'll notice is that, like, I haven't even opened it yet. It's all still, like, completely taped up. So as I talk to you, I'm going to get my scissors out, and I'm going to start opening this. And the one thing, the last couple of months, I had filmed, um, you know, Battle of the Boxes, the whole Ipsy and Birch Box thing, and try not to cut myself as I talk to you um, and I just never got them uploaded because I never had the chance to edit them and this time I said you know what I'm just gonna use my laptop because although the digital camera has a much better resolution um, this one here I can do it on my laptop and upload it immediately to YouTube and then it's up the same day I record it okay so here's my birch box so here we go and and the one thing I'll notice my birch box got scrunched I don't like that because I actually like to reuse these boxes. I, I really do. Um, and this is the first time that I've ever gotten one. Oh, it really got munched. <laughs> okay, so postal shipping was hungry this month and took a bite out of my birch box. It happens. Um, the other thing that I had a notice, and it, this happened, I think it came in my email yesterday. Um, and of course, you know, Katya signed it very nicely. So sorry, you received um, a previously received sample. And we don't like it when this happens, so we're putting 100 extra birch box points into your account, um, which is, you know, is it's like $10. So basically, this birch box was free because they, oopsie, put a previously used sample that I'd received before. And I've been with birch box for a little over a year now, so I'm kind of curious to see what they sent me. And they said, you know, hopefully you can use it again, or if you can't use it again, give it to a friend. All right, so it's Power Play. That's what's here this month. And we'll see what they sent me double up. All right, so the first thing that I see in here in my box is, ooh, here we go, scratch and score. Grab a coin and scratch out to find which deluxe minis you can get for free when you purchase any full-size benefit product when you spend $25 or more. So there's that. And they're also promoting um, this Stay Flawless 15 hour plus primer. The thing is, I was just at Ulta just a couple days ago and I asked about this and I tried it out and the one thing is, yes, it stays forever. And the girl who was helping me at Ulta says, yes, it stays forever, but it's really tacky. Um, and it also can make you look a little cakey. And she said she also is a birch boxer. <laughs> and she says, I think the reason that they're really like promoting this and you saw the whole Katia doing her, you know, here's what I do to make my makeup stay all month is because maybe Benefit is like, you know, their, their whole promotions this month is all for Benefit. Okay, so here it is. This is the, the one that I got before. This is the number four high performance um, super comb prep and protect but the thing is I liked this before so I just got this box for free because they sent me this and the one thing I'll tell you is that I like the way that it smelled yeah I like the way that it smelled it almost smelled a little chocolatey to me and uh, it's probably not any cocoa in there at all but it reminds me of chocolate that's what I liked about it. Um, it also worked really well on my hair and um, I'd spray it on before blow drying and it worked wonders. All right, so other things that I find in here. Ooh, I like this. It's Girl Meets Pearl, liquid pearl for face. And it's from Benefit. And it's probably super teeny tiny, but I like a lot of Benefit's products. And it comes in a little squeezy tube and it looks like this. It looks like it could be maybe a quarter of an ounce. Yeah, exactly quarter of an ounce and it's supposed to be an exquisite glow to pat it um, slightly pat over makeup for a soft pearlescence where alone I'm sure you could probably use it um, maybe a little bit underneath or mix it with your foundation and then pat that over um, and maybe maybe just use it places where you want to highlight like here you know down the 
lip or um, nose, <laughs> maybe Cupid's bow. Um, sometimes I like to wear it like instead of like right under your eyebrow, like right over your eyebrow. And I think that really helps to lift your whole face up. Um, being that I'm a little bit older demographic, 38 years old, instead of just highlighting underneath my brow, I like to give my whole face a lift and use but really, really subtle you know, highlighters and shimmers and stuff. Nothing that's really gonna be bling, um, but like right in here in this Girl Meets Pearl might be perfect for that. A great way to try it out. All right, so here, what's this? Um, G1 Boy and Girl Regulating Moisture Mattifying Face Cream. I don't know a lot about this. What does the card say? Um, I'm missing it here. It's a French bestseller. It hydrates, purifies, thanks to blueberries and dead nettle. <laughs> I get to put dead nettle on my face. Um, I wonder what it smells like. Well, this truly is an unboxing because I like to be more prepared. It doesn't smell bad. And it comes out looking kind of whitish. You know, rubs in nicely. It smells okay. Kind of smells um, like really high-end boutique-y. Doesn't smell like something you'd find at the drugstore. Yeah, smells okay. I like it. Um, and the Girl Meets Pearl, that's just, just because we can. Oh, it's foil sealed. But I'm going to try it anyway because I try everything from Birchbox all month long. Um, and this comes out, ooh, slightly pink. Um, it has a little shimmer to it. And there's kind of a little swath of it right here. This is a bad camera for swatching. I should really have used my HD camera. Um, and in the light, I'll just tell you because you won't see it on this camera here. Um, it is really a really light pearlescent sheen, like almost like you can't see it. So if you were to wear this, it would really give you that kind of nice glowy look without looking like you've got glitter or anything because it's not glitter. It's that girl meets pearl, almost that pearlescent look, but not scary, almost like Oh, she looks so glowy and dewy, and and it, it looks natural and nice, not like, oh, it's that. Okay, and then there's this little pillow pouch. And then in here, what did they give me? Ooh, they gave me, oh, how cute, these Birchbox bobby pins. And mine are in this cute little, I would say they're like an emerald green print. Super cute. I would totally wear those, but I have a lot of hair, even though it's straightened today. I got a haircut today, and I don't often wear my hair straight, but I might be able to, like, you know, pin a few of these back tomorrow if I still wear my hair straight. That'd be great. And then some of these guys. What is this? 100% Pure Green Apple Nourishing Body Cream. And these here are um, 0.066 fluid ounces or 2 mils. And body cream body cream. So I got three envelopes of these. Um, and I suppose since these are what? 100% natural, 100% vegan, which is interesting. I don't know why the, um, I guess maybe vegan is interesting. So you don't worry about animal products and these sorts of things, but two mils. So I got six mils total, which is not a lot of product. That's just under a quarter of an ounce total. But when you look at this, it's supposed to be um, nourishing, hydrating, concentrated, potent, anti-aging uh, with antioxidants, vitamins, fruit oils, cocoa, and avocado butter. And I would open up one of these foil packs, but I kind of don't want it to go everywhere because once you open this up, you kind of have to commit to using the whole thing because you can't just like, like with these guys, you just put the lid back on. And that's what I don't like about the foil packs these little envelope foil pack things. I'm not a fan, Birchbox. But I understand why these would be easy to get from the company because they make these to give out for nothing, you know? And these guys are kind of like a deluxe sample that you would get like at Sephora or at Ulta or whatever, especially when it comes in really cute packaging like this. It's definitely a deluxe sample. Um, this is definitely a deluxe sample. This, I'm sorry to say, it's not a deluxe sample, it's just a sample. Um, so yeah, um, overall I, I think it's okay. Um, I really think that these little birch box bobby pins are cute. Um, I would use these. Um, they may not be enough to hold my hair back, um, but either for my hair or my kids' hair, super cute, I have two little girls. Um, 
I like this a lot. This Girl Meets Pearl from, um, I've been wanting to try this highlighter um, from Benefit. Um, I really, I've liked this before and the fact that they sent it to me again, I'm not upset about that. And the fact that they gave me 10 Birchbox points because oops, they sent it to me again. I like that. <laughs> Hooray, Birchbox. <laughs> um, and then, you know, the rest of it, it was okay. Not bad. I don't know how I feel about this G1 Boys and Girls. Probably it's all right. Um, but I like that it's mattifying moisture. So that especially in the middle of summer, you don't get all greasy and s slicked up. And I, I can't really say how these are yet because I don't want to open up a whole foil pack and have it go everywhere. So yeah, that was what was in my birch box. It's not a bad birch box. Um, I want to see what Ipsy is like, but Ipsy has not arrived. So there we go. Hey, thanks for watching. Have a great day. I'll see you later.